I know when I went loose, natural, in my mind, I had a picture of what my hair was going to be or what I thought and I wanted my hair to be. And I realized, yeah, you don't have that hair. And no matter what product you get, like you will not have three A, three B, three, like I won't have that hair. That's just not me. So. Creatively analytic, Nat B, that's me. And today I'm bringing you a hair video. Really wasn't my intention, but um, yeah. I'm about to wash my hair and dye my hair. Um, because do you see the grays? The grays are popping, let me show you. Like this side is kids um, and hair and clients and yeah, yeah, whatever. But um, yeah, it's been almost a year since I cut my locks. If you haven't seen those videos, check them out. They'll be here, they'll be here, or they'll be somewhere. And in the description box as well. And I have playlists. Uh, and yeah, since then I've been um, just enjoying the loose natural journey. No plans to lock up. Like, I'm this is. Like, I'm so happy that it's everything I thought it was gonna be. Um, so yeah, I'm about to hop in the shower, wash my hair, really get up and go, I spritz my hair with water. Maybe put some products on there. To see the products that I use, check out this video. And yeah, check out my blog, cause I link to the products, which I'm not a product junkie. So I've been using these products since I cut my hair and when they finish, I'll get new products. Um, but yeah, I'm really, really happy with my hair. The key is finding a great barber. So I'm very happy with my barber and I've learned the lesson that stop barber hopping because yeah, you'll be unhappy. So since I've been consistent with the same barber, I've just been, I've just been enjoying the journey. Um, yeah, I did have some rocky times getting bad haircuts, but I've learned my lesson. I have learned my lesson and- I learned my lesson. This was, Last week I did my hair, I just did big twists, I believe, and then took it out. And then, you know, it was cute, I had a nice loose curl. And then one day, maybe the second day I ate um, with my girlfriends and we sat outside and the humidity got to it and it kind of, the definition went. And it's been pretty much looking like this. I actually do love as it gets older, um, these, it kind of does its own thing, like its own little coils. So I spritz it with water. I might put some product here. I roll the sides, kind of fluff this up, and I'm out. I don't have time to be doing all this hair. I'm sure I could be doing a better job with conditioning and putting on mask and doing all that. I love locks because they were low maintenance. If you haven't seen my lock videos, check those out. Um, I'm all for low maintenance. So. Yeah, it'd be cool to have this grow out more and see where that goes, but I'm sure in order for it to grow more, I need to be doing a better job of conditioning and doing all that. And yeah, I'm not, and I can't even say that I'm gonna commit to doing that. But anyway, I'm gonna wash. I really need you guys input as far as dyeing these grays, okay? When I had locks, I knew they were there, but they were like tucked in the locks for the most part. A couple would spring out and I'd like, I wouldn't tweeze them, but I'd like cut them right at the, the root. Now, they are just popping. And back to the previous point of me needing to do a better job taking care of my hair. I noticed when I scratched my hair, like I thought, I'm like, man, you got a lot of dandruff. Then I realized like, no, it's only been a week. I shouldn't have dandruff, but I realized my scalp was so dry. It was so dry, like I at least need to do better with that, putting oil on it every couple of days. So I did that. I went in there today and my scalp was like, oh, thank you. So yeah, I do need to do a better job, but please, this is what I'm gonna use to dye it. Beijing, Jet Black. Uh, did I use this before? I think I used this before and it didn't last long. Um, so yeah. What what can I use? We're gonna do it again. I'm gonna leave it in longer and we're gonna see how long it lasts. Mind you, I'm going on vacation next week and 
Well, I really won't be in, yeah. Normally I say I'd be all in the beach water, but I had a procedure done and I really can't be in the water like that. So we'll see. Anyway, let me hop in the shower. Let me wash this hair. Yeah, it's just, oh my gosh, I just love being natural. Like, I know everybody loves the, the loose curls and the, um, what is it? The, the C3, probably the threes, 3A, 3B, 3C, but the loose curls. Because I will tell you, I know you guys have a way of easier time come wash day and detangling because when I was loose natural, it was a work. It was like the whole weekend was spent detangling and doing all that. And I was like, I ain't doing that again. But I just love, I just love how it looks. I just, yeah, I just, I'm in love with my hair. So I just, um, yeah, I'm just in love with my hair. Because of that, you're probably thinking like, well, if you love your hair, you should take care of it better. This is what it is. It's the balance. I love, I'm good, I'm good. Um, but yeah, I do love my hair. And why that's important for me to verbalize is because most of my adult life has been in locks. So for those of you that are thinking about getting rid of your locks or it's time for you to start a new journey or maybe your locks aren't healthy because mine were not the, the healthiest because I would wear high ponytails and maybe I'll try to get a ponytail for you guys. No, I won't. Um, but yeah, there is life after locks. Yeah, I'm one of those people that I don't have to have a new hairstyle every couple weeks, like long hair, braids, this week, this, you know, switching it up every couple weeks. I'm not one of those people. So if you're one of those people, then you probably, yeah, I don't know. <sighs> when it gets cold, I'm gonna straighten it and see how um, that looks. But, um, but yeah, I'm rambling all. But do you see how like I'm manipulating? It gets like fluffier and bigger and I could probably pick it and all that stuff. But let me get washed. And then I'm gonna come back with this dye. We're gonna see this dye situation. Oh, I digressed again. I am like the shiny, the shiny object syndrome sometimes. But what I was saying is about the 3A, maybe the loose curl people is, you know, I know when I went loose, natural, in my mind, I had a picture of what my hair was going to be or what I thought and I wanted my hair to be. And I realized, yeah, you don't have that hair. And no matter what product you get, like, you will not have three A, three B, three C. Like, I won't have that here. That's just not me. So I'm happy that I'm able to love my hair as it is. I would say I'm a 4C. Um, so yeah, I do not have a natural curl. Like others, they can just put water in it and put product in it and put the brush through and then these curls just spring. Not, not with this. That's, that's not happening with this. But thank God for the sponge. I love it. All right, I'm really going in the shower now. A few minutes later. All right, I am out of the shower. Put on some lipper lips. If you have not seen that video, I'll enter it here. Go support. Get some lipper lips. Listen, I gotta give her some feedback. For her to make these smaller. Like, this thing has lasted me forever. She can't give us this much. It's the bomb, though. It is the bomb. Make them smaller because, yeah, it's, it's lasting forever. Okay. All right, hair is washed. My hair routine has pretty much stayed the same um, when I had my um, braid locks to now. I wash it weekly. I know I've mentioned in another video why I need to wash it weekly because my scalp. That was even when I had locks. My first set of locks, I used to have bad dandruff, dry scalp, even putting oil on it didn't help when I was going weeks without washing. Then I started interlocking and that helped because it didn't help with the dry scalp, but it helped keep my hair in place with me washing more often. So that's a tip if you're, you or somebody you know has locks and they're having issues with dry scalp, they may need to wash more. And then with braid locks, I would, it was interlocked. So I washed weekly. So I've kept the same routine. So this is my freshly washed hair and you can see the grays popping even more. <sighs> I have a friend that has gray hair, but it's like she had a, hers in like a patch. And I'm like, that looks intentional. That looks cool. So what I'm gonna do is put Vaseline on around my edges. And then I'm gonna put this in and I'm gonna let it sit. It says to let sit for, let's see, how long? Place plastic cap overhead and sit under a warm dryer. Maybe that's the trick. I'm not sitting under a dryer. I'm gonna cook dinner. 
And maybe before I wash it out, I'll sit under the dryer, but I know I'm gonna have this on over an hour. Um, so yeah, that's the plan. Okay, so I am putting on the Vaseline. So I've already done hair and hair, and I'm about to do this side. So you're supposed to go around the nape of your neck, but I'm not really caring about the back. All right, so it's Vaseline. That's much, about as much Vaseline as I'm gonna do. And now I'm gonna put on my gloves. Shower cap. Okay. Please. Oh, wow. Well, now you're an active participant for you. Okay. Can you reach? You can try, try the lower one. You know what? I'm not sitting under the dryer. I'm gonna try this. Let me wash my hands. Can you put on the water for me, please? Okay. I mean, I could throw out the gloves, but they don't have holes in them. I'm gonna keep. So wash my gloves so I can reuse those. And this is what I'm gonna do. I have this towel that I got, I think either from Walmart or Walgreens or something like that. Hmm? I said one of the walls. Yeah, one of the walls. So I'm gonna tighten this up to keep the heat in, then I'm gonna put this on to further keep the heat in. So hopefully this will act like the dryer and we shall see. And now you just tuck it in the back. So now I'm gonna go cook dinner. Well, Chrissy and I are gonna go cook dinner, my youngest baby, who has been helping me. She said she just came to watch, but she ended up helping. So yeah, I'm gonna go cook dinner and then I'll come back to you guys. A few moments later. All right, so I am in my half bathroom downstairs and I actually cooked dinner. It's about two hours later, more than two hours later. Cooked dinner, actually came back from the grocery store and I came, took this off my head, this off my head and I'm down here with a blow dryer doing this because maybe it's the heat that gets it to work. So I am trying that. Will I be doing it for 25, 30 minutes? Absolutely not. So I'm gonna give it another, let's say five minutes. So let me set my timer and get started again. All right, I'm done. I actually did five minutes. I put on my timer and I didn't think I was gonna do five minutes and I did it. So it says take off the cap and let your hair cool down. So I'm just gonna show you what it looks like. Like if this doesn't take, I, 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 just, I just, yeah, I need y'all to tell me what take, what will take. It looks, it looks good while it's on there. We'll see what happens when the water rinses out. Um, yeah, my hair's looking real special right now. I know there's grays right here, but I didn't bother going after those because I can get those, I can cut those down real easy and this get cuts often, so if I dye it, it's gonna grow out, man. Yeah. So let me go let this cool for a couple minutes and then I'm gonna rent it out. We are back, and I say we because my daughter's sitting on the tub and my hair is washed out. Let's see how it looks when it's rinsed out. It looks like it took. It looks like it took. I'm not even doing anything with it tonight. I'm gonna put some leave-in conditioner in my hair. <sighs> do I wanna do anything with it tonight? I don't, I don't know if I'm doing anything with it tonight. But 
The leave-in that I'm using is Preference Premium, their Restore Tonic. And actually my friend Talina Christine has her product line and this is the product. I also have the shampoo and the conditioner. So I'm just gonna put this in. I'm gonna wait to oil my scalp. <laughs> This works, man. It must be that heat. I'm gonna say it's the heat. We're gonna see how long this lasts. Yeah, it said to. Well, I was supposed to sit under the dryer, but. So, it looks like it worked, but I'm going to let it dry. May or may not put Big Twist in it tonight. We'll see how I'm feeling after I get done with this laundry. So, um. I'll come back with it dried and styled or whatever I decide to do. Three days later. Okay, so how many days later is this? So I washed my hair on Saturday. Today's Tuesday and I've been wearing hats and my hair looks like a helmet. I, it has never looked like this. I've always done something with my hair after washing it for the week to style it for the week. And normally Tuesdays will be my haircut day, but my haircut is not until Thursday because I'm going on vacation. Uh, but I, this, I can't do this. I need to make it look like something. So this is gonna be a real challenge. So I sprayed my first round of water, but it is still humidity. So. I'm gonna go ahead and do my hair. There's not gonna be much talking in this video. It's early and yeah, we're just gonna get this done. just so dry so one thing I could do is like you know, let it dry a little bit come back and sponge some more so in this video I'll have it here um, one of my lovely um, subscribers mentioned this product and I went and bought it and I will have the link down below I bought it off of Amazon and I wanted to make sure that I really bought the product from the young boys that actually made it because they were on Shark Tank. And I remember seeing a follow-up episode where people were um, basically bootlegging their product. So I wanted to make sure I got their product. So, okay. So let's try this and see if it... This is gonna be what I'm working with until I go get a haircut and she shapes me up. And then I'm gonna wash it and twist it. And yeah, that'll be my base for the week. So what normally happens is I'll wash it, do a twist or something to stretch it a little bit and have some definition for a couple of days. And then after, a couple of days, the definition will kind of go away or as I'm putting product on it and it will shrink more and look more like this, but even still better than this. So if you're not doing anything to it and you're just gonna wet it. So for example, while I'm on vacation in beach, whatever we're doing, pool and my hair is wet, this will be the look that I have because twisting it just doesn't make sense if I'm gonna be in water, um, but yeah. Yes, I am happy with the dye. The next time I will, may put it all over and I'll see how often I need to do it. But it did get rid of those grays and I really think that it was the heat that did it. So anyway guys, links for the products that I use will be down below. Also check out my blog. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. Let me know if there's any other products I should be trying that are really good. Um, you guys know I'm not a product junkie, but I'm open to trying some more. Oh, wait, 
This thing had do's and don'ts. Do, you want to twist with pressure, use promenades, butters, and oils, use holding gels and waxes or holding sprays if your hair is mixed or soft. They recommend red one gel wax. Wax, find your curl pattern clockwise, counterclockwise, or maybe both. Watch the how-to videos. The don't, stay away from water. If your hair is too wet, the comb will not be able to grab your hair. Well, my hair was wet at first, okay? Hair moves, cream, bleeding conditions, softer, soften the hair. And application of these products are not recommended after your hair is twisted, not before, after, okay? Here, every hair texture is different and has its own unique process. We wanted to make a high quality product that was cleanable, portable, and save customers money. We appreciate your purchase. All right, so yeah, I'm signing out here. Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, have a positive, peaceful, and productive day, and I'll see you guys in my next video.